Good boy reefers, I'm Daniel, and those of you who have been patiently waiting for me to finally finish this video so that I could publish it so you guys could vote on um, the tanks for the $300 giveaway contest, um, it's finally here, the day has come. I'm going to publish this today, thank you for waiting, and those of you who did enter your submissions, I'm going to read off your tanks and just kind of give everyone a background uh, of the pictures that you submitted. So if you didn't post anything, I'll just show the pictures. But um, thank you for those of you who took the time to write something. And here we go. First off, we have Anonymous. He picked up his tank as somebody was getting out of the hobby about a year ago. And this system looks pretty well established and pretty beautiful, which is nice to get someone's tank who's already set up. So you know you got a full complete system and you're able to run it properly right away and they pretty much worked out the kinks for you. So that's always great when you can pick up a tank. So here's this beauty, check it out. Also these beautiful mushrooms, this rock is completely covered. Sweet. These are some really nice pictures of Brendan Voden's tank. Thanks for sharing with us. I absolutely love the rainbow egg cans and anemones. This Monty cap is really cool and your tank looks like it's doing pretty well so far. Keep up the good work. It's crazy. How you've lost it. This entry is for Coral Boss and he went through a traumatic loss and due to a fire lost his reef and tank many years ago. So these are what he had I'm assuming but I appreciate the entry and his favorite is an Achilles Tang this tank belongs to Jazips it's a beautiful reef and he wants to replace these pallies in the top and go with more SPS since these Kessels are giving him so much light he wants to try something a little bit harder so that would be pretty cool this beautiful tank belongs to Lester Lloyd and he got into the hobby and one of his favorite corals from the beginning has been the elegance this picture belongs to Louis SPS this is a deep water aqua that he has had that has been knocked over several times and he has kept it alive and brought it back to life through several issues. So he's pretty proud of that piece. And also this other picture, picture is his 75 gallon, now four year old reef. This is always good to hear. These pictures are from Nano Dad's tank. He is brand new to the hobby. This is his very first attempt at a reef tank. Um, this is a Fluval Evo 13.5 and he has been doing really well. Check out this open brain coral that he acquired. He calls it Matilda. This gorgeous tank belongs to Patrick and he also has a YouTube channel called Under the Sea Ship. Uh, make sure you check it out. And his favorite coral is the frog spawn. He has nurtured this thing back from an ugly frag. He got it for a discount and then nurtured it back to health which is pretty awesome. I always appreciate coral that you get like that and then bring them back to life. So pretty nice there. Fuang51, his favorite fish is the mandarin and he gave up his fresh water tank to go to a 75 salt water so he could keep a mandarin. These fish are absolutely stunning to watch and are entertaining enough by themselves to keep in a reef tank. This beautiful tank belongs to Reefer Dan. Thanks for sharing the pic. That looks pretty well established. Wow, this looks like a nice clean setup, very well organized. Good job, SC Reefer. Um, you can also check out his channel. He has a YouTube channel. And he's just starting out. Look at this tank. Definitely could use some more Euphelias, but you got a great start so far. Those pieces look awesome. This tank belongs to Slivers. These um, names are probably not meant to be read out loud, but there you go. Um, his favorite coral is the Pearl Berry, and it's one of mine too, especially when it's colored up. And I understand what you're feeling with those T5s and the pop. If you've owned the Radions before, 
going back to the T5s can be a little painful. But you're doing a great job, and once you do get some extra tinnix, it'll look even better. So keep up the good work. I couldn't manage to get a copy of the picture, but Becca73 favorite coral is Euphelia, which is a golden torch uh, with blue tips that she got. That was a gift from her boyfriend. So that is an awesome coral. I'll fill it in. This isn't the one, but this is a rainbow torch. Okay, well that's it for the entries for now. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing those corals and those tanks. I'm going to post um, a link with everything with each person's entry and then you guys can vote on it based on their name. So I'll put the timing in part of the video so when you watch it, you can know you're voting on with the names. So that way the person with the most votes, the most likes, will be the winner. And we'll let it run for about a week. That way people have a chance to vote, those who are busy who haven't had a chance to see the video. So we'll see how this contest goes so far. Sorry um, it took so long and I do feel a little disorganized. But thank you so much, those of you, like I said, are sticking with us. It's just supposed to be fun. So we'll see what happens from here. Thanks for watching, and as always, happy reefing. Stay tuned for the next one.